mics and tell me yes yes hey we will create some okay i am sharing my screen i believe that in this session there might be a lot of people who are new to the world of visual thinking sketch noting and there might be and i already see there are some pro levels as well the, the top notch levels as well so we have all kind of um, fellows today let me quickly share my screen to share what is about visual thinking so that we all have some idea around it okay so let's see okay so let me do a slide show here so today we are here to learn about business sketch notes using ai quick check you are able to see my screen yeah 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 my yeah 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 now who will be helping you today i am piyush i am more often known as curious piyush that's my instagram as well and i am the founder of visual thinking school netherlands and we give a lot of trainings around visual thinking and with me today will be the founder of droify excel who has hi everyone <laughs> a fabulous software and we have we'll have a dedicated yeah. time with excel as well today so this is cool that the founder herself is here now without even doing any jazzy things quickly come down to what are sketch notes for those who's for whom sketch note is a new word let's see what are sketch notes now a typical example of a sketch note is this now imagine what can visuals do to you you all know that visuals can cut through complex data technical jargons and they show us clarity right now i could have shown this in a very boring textual format in a big paragraph format right but what i did the slide which you are able to see is a visual slide this is a sketch noted slide call it a visual storytelling call it a visual sketch note this is what a typical sketch note is let me show you some other examples as well before examples why we need sketch notes in general and why just a textual slide is not enough because of this folks many a times when you go you work in companies you have seen that people from technical background or let's say a financial background or law background they talk in their own language but they have to produce things for a business right it could be an internal business or it could be an external business but many a times they talk in their language which is 0101 which is not understood by the end users the end user which is your business wants something which is user friendly which is which shows the usability there is where sketch notes and storytelling comes into play and that's the communication gap which is fulfilled by sketch notes or story this is a theoretical part of it i know nobody mute your mic folks we have 99 people i'm yeah. muting you okay and i think more than 100 won't be able to join this so i didn't expect that there will be more than 100 people joining it so right now we are full house i am sorry for all those who are not able to join okay now let me show you some examples uh let me show you some examples okay before even showing you some examples let's see how this gap is fulfilled in different you can i ask you something since people yeah. are maybe waiting maybe we can record the session i know it was not foreseen but maybe we can record it so that people who were not able to join still can see. see this is already recording i ah, it's I, recording I, okay then it's okay great thanks so sorry for interrupting yeah. yeah okay so again going back to the last slide back so this is the gap which we have realized that this is the gap which needs to be fulfilled and how these gaps are fulfilled is by three ways and this is a typical business scenario which you must be very aware of so in any business let's say you have a department an it department which goes to the client to understand what they require so there is a requirement gathering session that there you can use business sketch notes instead of taking normal notes take visual notes second is you come back to your team and you start a process you start running you start developing a service or a product that is where the facilitation comes part and the facilitation is a big big ocean in which you start doing things visually or using visual action boards you have developed something and then you go back to the client or your business and present them now and this is where business presentations comes into picture that can be done into visual storytelling way very quickly i am telling you that these are the three techniques which we visual thinkers follow when we are serving a client or let's say when we are in a business setup i am asking you very quickly if there, is, if there is any doubt ask me now i always give opportunity to ask this is not a webinar this is almost a conversation if you have any doubts ask me on this slide this is clear 
and this is the power of visual slides when there is a visual slide nobody asks too many questions because it's already so clear so visually enabled and when you have to think that you have to become a visual manager this is the learning path which is to become a visual manager which means everything starts with building a visual vocabulary today i will show you as well how a software can help us building our visual vocabulary once you have built your visual vocabulary you can combine your vocabulary to make visual stories and visual sketch notes and the third level is you can after developing this language after having command on this language you will be able to engage more people with you and do things together that is where visual facilitation comes into play right this is the journey of becoming a visual super manager today's focus is sketch notes so i'll be showing you more examples on sketch note today let's see what a typical sketch note is and i know one person from this group will be very surprised because she is my workshop participant i am showing her work this is a typical sketch note folks so even if you are doing a surya namaskar let's say what is called a sun salutation it could be sketch noted in this format and not writing in big paragraphs similarly she was doing a live sketch noting today when she was attending by the way her name is lavanya lavanya are you there open your mic and say hi hello everyone i am here she is a school teacher by the way and this is our effort to take visual sketch notes into classrooms and probably excels efforts as well second slide i am showing you more sketch notes just to show you what real sketch notes are now you can see these are hand drawn sketch notes now these sketch notes could be on paper or even on a uh, or on a digital tab or any but see the styling if you are new to the world of sketch notes this is what are sketch notes in you are basically making points in a visual format now once you grow from this this takes shape of visual storytelling as well so this is again a format of sketch note in which this was a sketch note made by me when i was teaching them how to run a 10 day facebook ads and this was explained in the format of a road map let's see more examples let me ask you one question have you seen these kind of slides how many of you have seen this kind of slide yes or no okay say yes folks open your yes, mic yes yes yes, 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 yes all the time all the time kind of slides yes, right yes and this is when you see two of these slides and then the second the third expression would be um yawning and you know why you yawn when you see these slides because this is unreal these are mathematical symbolisms you don't see this object in the nature have you seen any have you seen in nature this kind of a object which looks like this flow chart have you seen this in nature anyone never no. never and that is why your brain thinks oh my god this is mathematical this is something new i have to put in more efforts and your brain goes for a toss do you know how you can convert this let's say a project kick off which has project purpose project scope goals all these are modalities of this topic this can be converted into this now this is the power when you draw it in the form of a road map or it or it can be any format you will remember this because there was a scooter there is a telescope which is a product purpose there is a road which has a bump which has project risk there is a goal shown in the form of a sun you will remember this story already in your mind and that's when these pointers this thunderstorm will come as a project pressure this you will automatically remember and that's the power of visual storytelling it goes like this as well so i have shown you road map in this way this is this can also be a road map in which you can use a road and then the metaphors in the road and i'll show you how a software can do this for us a complex form of sketch noting is also called graphic recording in which let's say a session is going ahead today excel was busy in graphic recording i assume she was sending us pictures when a session is going on you can take live notes on a big sheet of paper and that's called sketch uh, graphic recording as well these were some of the examples i wanted to just quickly show you before we actually go on the topic is there any doubt in this folks ask me now what is sketch note what is storytelling what is facilitation are you almost thorough that what is this i'm just quickly repeating the slides any questions ask me all good okay all good all, all good. good then all let good. me go and go to the the page for which we are here today okay let me first open oh i can share my screen okay so let's go to an incognito window and let's open drawify so what we visual thinkers thought we thought 
that most of the things are done on paper and pen, right? And many of you who have attended my workshop have seen that this is a paper and a pen thing, right? But uh, there is a lot of situation in which you might think that, hey, Piyush, uh, I don't have the time to use pen and paper. I need something like a drag and drop. And then that's why led by Excel, she included all of us and she developed this software, this app, which is a drag and drop software, which can draw sketch notes for you digitally. And not only digitally, today we'll be especially focusing on can an AI draw our sketch notes automatically. So this is Drawify folks. Let me give you a very brief of what Drawify and then we'll start working on it. So as I told you, Drawify is made by the Drawifiers and we Drawifiers have contributed to this, which means that Drawify is, has man-made or customized icons and metaphors which are made, which are contributed by these people. Excel has started it and all those are fabulous folks, apart from me, who have contributed to the Drawify community. I'm lucky to be the only Indian and probably one of the couple Netherlands folks who have also contributed to it. So let's go inside it and see what is Drawify and how Drawify is now AI enabled and be ready for that magic. But before that magic, I want to hear your energy out. Open your mics and tell me, are you ready to see some magic today? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Of course. Of course. Okay. I hope this was not faking. You were doing it in real. <laughs> okay. So I'm increasing my uh, size. I mean, size as in uh, the, the browser size. Let's go to the project. I am going on the project and clicking on new. Now, before I, even I go to the Drawify thing, Drawify has this thing generate. Now, let me show you some magic here. Okay, most of the folks who are joining right now are from India, I see. And folks tell me, this is October 6th. What was that recent holiday which you have enjoyed in India? What was that holiday? Gandhi Jayanti. Gandhi Jayanti, which means the birthday of Mahatma Gandhi. And for... Let's give a tribute to Mahatma Gandhi. And now, I don't know, let's say, uh, in 10 minutes, I have to do a presentation of Mahatma Gandhi. And I don't know how to make a presentation. The best thing I can do is put it, uh, you know, full this, fill this uh, with a, a lot of text. But I don't want to do it because I want to make it sketch note way. Let's see what it can do. Go on the left panel. And on the second one, you can see generate. And it already has the magic van. And let's see what this magic van can do. I am asking this, make a presentation on Mahatma Gandhi and include six points of his personality. Do you think this is a typical slide which we make even in schools or let's say in any situation? I am yeah. just jumping on a very, very basic thing. And then we'll, of course, switch to the business things as well. But let's see if this can work. And folks, be with me. This is very new. And this is probably the only software which is which is trying to make a sketch note. So even if there is an error, please be please show some empathy towards Myra. And this is Maya. The spelling is M-A-I-A, -A, which also has a very English, Indian tone. Maya, how many of you know what the meaning of Maya in, in, in Hindi, in English? I mean, sorry, in India? Maya means magician, right? Illusion. Illusion, Illusion. but still as well. Let's see what Maya can do for us. Folks, this software knows who Mahatma Gandhi is. And do you think this? these are the pointers which should be there? He was a non-violent, uh, he, he was into non-violence, equality and social justice, legacy and inspiration, simplicity and self-sufficiency, civil disobedience movement he did. Now, this is a software which is trying to do. Of course, Mahatma Gandhi didn't look like this. Why this is an error, if you call this an error, because this is not picking up images from Google. Any idea from where this is picking up images? This is picking up images from all the contributions. Drawify. Drawify. All these images which has been contributed by humans. It is not a software generated illustrations. All humans have contributed to this. Probably there is not a Mahatma Gandhi picture. For this, what you can do, you can delete this and now go on, for example, let's say Mahatma Gandhi. 
and I will go on Mahatma Gandhi and probably because this is so doodly, I will search Mahatma Gandhi doodle and maybe this and I will download this or probably I will just make a screenshot of this. Save it and you know, you can upload it. So here it goes. I'm saving it and here it goes. This is download and let's say Gandhi. And what happens next? I am going to my DroyFi and now here. So see how we are also experiencing how DroyFi works. Upload, go on upload and then upload the image and Gandhi is here. It comes here and now you can pull Gandhi here. So this becomes and similarly you can pick up illustrations from these words as well. Let's do more. Now non-violence. Maybe you would want and this is only a basic um, sketch note which the software has made. We will try more versions as well, but let's see what the general draw if I can do non resistance. Now I want to have some non violence thing here. I will go on illustrations and now search non violence. Okay. Let's see what draw if I now draw if I doesn't have the exact image for non violence. Maybe I can do a smart search. So now see here, there's a smart search here and let's see if smart search can do something for us non violence. Now, here it comes. Now, non-violence, probably this is a nice one for non-violence. Right? And I'm pretty sure soon there will be API integrations which can actually make these illustrations on the spot as well. But till now, we are dedicated to human drawings. Humans are drawing these, these drawings. Otherwise, you already know in AI, there is something called mid-journey which can draw on its own. But those are very uh, picture-based. They cannot draw doodles for that matter. But... This is how I you can. I have a question. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you, the image of Gandhi, uh, Mahatma Gandhi, which you took, uh, can it be used in this format, uh, even though you're mixing it up with other elements from the AI without yeah. any, uh, you know, giving photo credit like this? Because in companies. No, no. Of course, you have to get photo credit. So, yeah, this is this I missed. So maybe you can write here this photo was picked up from this site. I mean, which site? This site. Alame something. But. You can, so this is one, one thing you should definitely give uh, photo credits, but DrawFi also has system called draw. So if you are, I'm not sure if you can draw very nicely with your mouse, but I already have a laptop on which I can draw with my electronic pencil, pick up this marker and draw. So probably, yeah, I'm using a mouse, but I'm just showing you an example that you can draw your own figures as well. So that means that that is you. So for example, if I have to show, um, let's say, who is a doctor, maybe I'm showing five qualities of a good doctor. Now I can easily draw a doctor. So here is my doctor. I'm using my mouse. So don't judge me on my drawings, but that's okay. So if this is here, my doctor should be smiling and my doctor should have this kind of a thing on his neck. Right? <clears throat> And my doctor should always be with specs. And my doctor should not have more hairs. My doctor should always have this much hair. I don't trust doctors who have good hair. So this is my doctor. I've just drawn very quickly from the mouse. So this becomes your drawing. So this has a facility of drawing as well. But you get the hang of it, right? One quick thing which you should know, let's say you are non violence is here, equality. Let's see if I can do a smart search here and search equality. Equality, maybe equality. I don't think Gandhi may, meant only gender equality, but it was all kind of equalities. Uh, here, maybe this, maybe this is equality for me. And now you are already realizing that this pigeon is gray color and this these guys are yellow color. Maybe to have that coherency or match my brand color, I would want this pigeon to be yellow. Maybe I'm just giving you examples. You can change. So it all works almost like yeah, you already know how Canva works. The whole working model is Canva based, but this is how you can do the edits as well. But I want to show you more examples on the generate part. So this is where my slides are getting generated. So Mahatma Gandhi slide is generated. I can easily, maybe I want to change color of this as well. This is changed. This is done. Let's see what else it can do. Now, I have picked up some examples. How many of you have read uh, that book, uh, Rich Dad, Poor Dad? Yeah, we have. I yeah, I have. Let's see if our software can pick up few things. So, 
make a presentation on rich dad poor dad make a presentation on the book on the book rich dad and poor dad and include six uh include six points from the book let's see if the our maya can understand this if she has also read rich dad poor dad and what she can do excel you i know your heart must be pounding i'm taking very difficult examples <laughs> and this being your daughter look at this folks now can you compare or can you imagine what kind of slide you might have made and what kind of slide this software has made to be honest i'll tell you this is there is a way long way to go when this software can also make human like slides but this is so exclusive a task but being a visual thinker myself trust me i am already happy if a software can develop this kind of a slide for me so and even if the software can understand what a rich dad and poor dad is if i am rushing i am happy with this slide so rich dad and poor dad told about financial wisdom lessons from rich dad poor dad mindset shift financial education importance of cash flow building assets breaking the cycle and financial independence what do you think about this folks i want to hear you all what do you think do you think this is this is great we are Yeah. yeah, it is good. Yeah, but there is one important thing missing: uh, that cash flow diagram of four quadrants. That is okay, okay but this is yeah, good no. Enough. Correct. This is good enough, and that's how our we are trying to make it more intelligent. But cash flow diagram. Let's see what happens. So, can I go on my illustrations and come to cash flow diagram? I don't know if somebody. You can write cash flow quadrant. It will. Okay. It should identify. Ah, uh, cash flow quadrant better. would be better. Okay, yeah. so let's. see if our software can understand and this is i'm trying by my own let's see so let's say can you make cash flow quadrant from rich dad and poor dad i'm pretty sure it won't be able to make because let's see because these are it picks up images from our database so i don't know if a quadrant is if this quadrant is available but if she is let's see even i have not done this let's see so it can explain you and draw these but the quadrant was not made good good but, good. but this is also yeah, good yeah at least it can explain and maybe you can pick up a scene you already know how to draw with this pen you pick up a marker and draw this a quadrant draw a quadrant and maybe then you can place these pointers there so yes. all these are yeah uh let me disable the pen so all these pointers so for example maybe i can pick this complete section go to my slide and paste it here so maybe this was my quadrant are you realizing the time saving we are how much time we are saving here any other doubts any other permutation and combination you want me to try on this generate thing shall we during our instruction it served when you asked for to write i know generate the summary of uh, the book can you also add with elements in that way would it give the elements along with the just keywords give me, give me an example for example what do you want to write give me so uh, uh, you are on right uh, so explain the six qualities of mahatma gandhi ji with elements for each points oh the explanation okay let's see uh, yeah. explain six qualities of mahatma gandhi um uh, also add um also add explanation to each point each of the six point let's see not explanation elements because instead of adding the pigeon uh, all of it uh, uh, separately okay could it give the elements let's try let's try let let it generate something okay at least it did what it what i asked so six qualities and these are the qualities wow actually it we have a gandhi picture as well excel very nice <laughs> okay these are the qualities folks so truthfulness non violence simplicity self discipline empathy leadership let's what did you ask uh, apart from so, explaining yeah, in canva it's elements here it is illustrations so 
add yeah. illustration for each point. But it has already added illustrations for each point. Yeah, but in that flow, like in the first picture where okay. add illustration uh, to also each add point illustration to each of the six point. And we will do more. So okay, we will pick. I'm copying this because we'll pick this as example. Let's see what it does. It will make a new slide. Guys, why don't we, okay, next time we'll do something. So again, six pointers, but it has picked up these kind of illustrations. So maybe these illustrations are the best understood illustrations by the software, uh, but self-discipline, maybe you want to add something else as well, right? So understand that this is picking up from our database and we are adding more and more to the database. But let's do one more thing here. In the same example, I want to write here, make it in a pathway format, pathway format. Maybe I don't want this in this column wise format. I want a roadmap kind of a thing, or let's say call it a roadmap, roadmap format. I don't know. Wow. I will be surprised if she can take this out. Folks, why don't we open our camera and encourage our Myra and say magic, show us magic, 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 magic. Open your camera. Yeah. Let's encourage Maya. She has some intelligence. She has some emotions as well. Look at that. Oh, wow. That's so Guys, nice. I, I think you should be a little satisfied with the result. She That's understood amazing. what the roadmap is. And I can tell you, I take the responsibility. There is no other software to the level I have researched that can do this. That it understands a pathway format and a different format. I would again test this Maya thing. And Excel, I'm so sorry. I'm testing your baby to its limit. Make it in a matrix format. Let's see if it can understand matrix. Maya, 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 Maya. <laughs> Piyush, we can add the text also inside the containers, right? Like the yeah. where the leadership is mentioned. Yeah. We can add some more text. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Guys, well done, Maya. At least this is called matrix format. And me being me, a harsh demander, I will ask Maya to make it as make it in a uh, in a mandala format. I don't know if she will under. I'm pretty sure she won't understand mandala, mandala format. I will also give her circular format, but let's see. This will I'll be too much to expect. Sensitive content found. What was so sensitive oh. about this? Okay, I'm refreshing oh. it. <laughs> the prompt is not in English language. <laughs> Probably, yeah, this could be a reason. So I'm generating again, but let's see if, uh, okay, make it, make, make it in a, a radial, let's call it a radial format, make it in a radial format, format. Let's see if this, she can pick up. Maya, Maya, come on, guys, come on. Maya, 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 Maya. you can Maya. do it. <laughs> oh, hmm. Maya is growing, folks. She's just a kid. She's yeah. growing. She's growing. So maybe uh, this might be a learning as well uh, for us, uh, Excel, that if she can understand things like this, radial means circular, or maybe we can feed her with hundred formats yeah then, yeah we are adding we're try adding. circular Piyush. try circular maybe it's a recognized word yeah could be good one sir q sir q learn spiral you can say spiral also spiral okay but we are adding formats uh very soon so uh, <laughs> because yeah. they are much more than what we see now so i don't know why it's sticking to the same all the time okay but path and format she doesn't understand circular but so these were all uh, general day-to-day -day things. Okay, folks, I always have this bad habit of giving you more than what I am supposed to, but let me show you one super fantastic thing and you will be, and especially for all the content creators, folks, let me give you an idea here. I'm going on my projects because I already created a project. I wanted to show you as example. So this is what I got from Maya when I, when I gave, gave her a prompt, uh, let it load. projects i'll again go on my projects oh open okay maybe uh let me refresh it again 
I'll go on my projects, projects, open, right? Open. And now I made this one. Where is this one? Where is this one? Uh, wait. This will be something very cool which I'm going to show you. I'm always a believer of what to do with all these and rather than just creating all this, uh, I think I lost that presentation or maybe say something wrong, but let's put this way. Um, okay. Let's pick up this one. Somehow she is not able to pick my previous projects. I don't know why. We can make one new. Okay. Uh, where is the generate thing? Generate thing. Okay, let's take this. So these, have you heard of sort analysis? Now, okay, I want to do it from scratch. So I want to ask Maya, oh, because this slide was made, there are too many things in this slide, okay. Um, I want to start a new project, folks. And then I will click on new, and then I want to ask Maya, okay. What should we ask? Again, let's say, give me six, points from rich dad and poor dad book okay and you know we are right now using only drawify i am pretty sure some of you the tech folks are already thinking piyush what if i can open a chat gpt in a new browser and what amazing things can happen you already know what can happen. And I'm not showing you that today because it will take a lot of my time, but I'll show you when I'm showing you the chat GPT integration as well. But let's say we have created this. Look at this. What a fabulous slide. All the six pointers of rich dad and poor dad. And what I'm going to show you is this. Let me reduce the, let me reduce this so that everything is. Now, folks, how many of you are content creators on Instagram? Give me a yes. Give me a yes or no. Right. And which kind of yes. content is the best for Instagram and social media? Which kind of content? Visual. Visual means what kind of visual? <laughs> reels. Are you all scrolling through reels? Yes. Reels gets the most kind of engagement. But we have created a slide in less than a minute. And how difficult is creating content on social media? But let me show you how easy it is to create a reel out of it. Now, what you can do here is and people who are from my group, for my special visual masters group, they already know I've shared with you all recently. Do this, go on draw, go on glow function and increase the size of this. And do one thing, maybe the first color is pink and I am closing this with this. Oh, wait. Yeah, and then maybe I'm picking up blue. And then I'm, don't, don't, hide everything let there be curiosity so people already know that you are showing something visual what i'm doing here so basically i am hiding these pointers now try this which of course i'll not be doing right now open your phones okay let me take this thing here so this is my camera here is my screen and now i keep my camera here okay so imagine that you are putting your camera like this and recording this. This is being made as a reel. Now what to do? Imagine your camera is here. Ah, oh, are you able to see my camera? Oh, yeah, of course you are able to see my camera as well. Now imagine that this video is on and now what you are doing is I'm again putting my camera back and I'll be enacting a reel here. Okay. So how will I enact? Imagine my camera is open and I'm making a quick 30 second reel. Hey guys, today I'll be showing you six wisdoms from rich dad and poor dad and when you are explaining this, your camera is already focusing on the slide. Put the eraser here and then open the magic. I will be showing you financial wisdoms from rich dad and poor dad. And point number one is your mind shift, mindset shift. And point number two is something here. Point number two is financial education. And point number three is investment assets. And point number four is building passive income. And point number five is avoiding debt traps. This creates an opening of a, you know, how you, in, on the stage, when you open the wheel, this creates that kind of sensation. And this works on social media, which especially when you are creating reels. I'm pretty sure people who are active on social media, they are, they are already excited hearing this. Imagine how quickly we created this slide 
and that to a visual slide and this becomes your real content as well. Right? So use this format. Now, I would call Excel herself. Excel, maybe you want to add something to this. And after that, I'll also show what are the pricings and how you can get this at a heavy discount. And even for free, by the way, I'll show you how to get this for free. And Excel will hate me for this. But Excel, right now, I want to invite mm -hmm. you to yeah. show us if there are other business formats as well. Maybe this can create a KPI or maybe our smart charts or all the uh, business templates as well. I already know that there are, we have business templates. What do you want to do? You want to share your screen or you want to guide me through it? Um, well, um, <laughs> I didn't prepare this. <laughs> so, um, well, maybe one thing I can say, but you pro pro probably also didn't prepare it, but instead of asking questions, you can also just put, uh, put um, text there, with, which I did uh, last week. I had to visualize very yeah. complex content for a client and I had a text, it was about internal auditing and I got a text with 10,000 characters and I've put it in Maya and I asked to summarize in uh, eight points and um, and then I got a summary and then based with that summary, I could create in 10 minutes, I create a whole visual story for that client. And last year I did the same visual story for that client and it, it took me like almost a day to go through the text, to read, to understand because it was really, really complex. Uh, so it, it took me a long time and now it took me 15 minutes <laughs> because I didn't have to summarize it and I didn't have to do it. Uh, Maya did it for me. So that was, um, that was really easy. So I think that could be done. And also if you have reports of meetings, you could even uh, visualize it. I didn't try it, but I know that Zoom has, for instance, um, Companion, which gives yeah. you the report of a meeting. And if someone wants to try it and let me know how it works, because I didn't write it, but I think that's also nice that you can... Uh, I did a so, World War II. Yeah. It's definitely the World War, uh, big paragraph of 5,000 words. Uh, but of course it is missing out on the details, but it... Yeah, yeah, but can yeah. you regenerate, uh, because you didn't, can you do generate again? Then uh, you probably get something else with more text. What I realized is uh, I was trying it today. And when you give uh, Maya point-wise descriptions, then it works even better. Oh, look at that. So now you get more text. So depending uh, when you regenerate or if you change a little bit in the text or you give another instruction, you get a different result. Um, yeah, so that's, and then of course, but yeah, that's not the, the Maya part, but you also have uh, 200 templates in um, in Droify that you can adjust. Um, I don't know if you know that. So there are 200 templates that you can adjust and start from there if you don't want to generate it, but you want just to create something yourself, but really, really quickly without having to design it yourself, you can take one of the templates also, which is really easy. And for the search, I will always recommend to search for the smart search because you, then you always get results. Um, with a normal search, you can, um, yeah, you can run out of this uh, of results, but then the smart search will always find results. So um, that's uh, and sometimes you get results you don't expect. Yeah. Excel, uh, right. one. Uh, it is mandatory for the entire team to be working on Droify, right? So, for example, let's say you you have a design team and a tech team and a product team working together, and the product team wants to use Droify, but the tech team does not want to use Droify, and you want to create like one deck. I mean, in banking, we still do it in uh, PowerPoint. So, I'm assuming in this case, the whole team has to have the Droify. Uh, you can account you can. and. Yeah, if you want to work in the same deck, if you want to work in the same um, file, yeah, because you can export a file and then someone else can work further on it. Yes, that's true. Then the other person has to needs to have a, a Droid file. You can also, of course, export as a PNG. You get all the, the files as a PNG. You can put it in PowerPoint and you can still work from there, of course. So uh, sometimes I have a client who works in PowerPoint then I do all the visuals and then the client adds his text in, in PowerPoint sometimes. But um, yeah, you can also work together and then you have to export indeed in the other person. Oh, yeah, that's what I was asking. Thank you. Yeah. So yeah. I can show the export. The export is in PNG, JPG yeah. or PDF format. And it can also be, yeah. when you export the project here, it also gets exported in a Droify dot, dot Droify file, yeah. which can be opened by another Droify and which will open in this format. So if I go to my downloads, you will see that this is getting downloaded in a .droify format. 
which is of course not visible to a PDF or something, but it can be opened by another Droify uh, account. But if you want a PDF or something, it can be done by PNG, JPG, and PDF. Uh, these are the formats. Yeah, indeed. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, and then there is text as well, header, subheader, paragraph. You already know that. And we have languages here. So as well, you can change it in uh, in Hindi as well. We still have that uh, those local languages, Excel, right? Indeed, yeah. Yeah, so this is a typical thing which you already know, the text format and everything else. I also love the draw format. Uh, try to uh, have Drawify if you have iPads uh, or if you have a drawing laptop, try to have there and then it becomes super easy. I use this pen on my laptop and then everything is, I also use Canva drawing facility, for example. I also use Drawify drawing facility. Then these things uh, are, uh, are there. And a little bit of self-promotion here. If you go on illustrations, and if you only want uh, specific dry fires uh, illustrations, then you can also search Curious Piyush. And then you will see all my drawings <laughs> if you are a bit of my fan. And I don't know why it is not showing. These are all my drawings, which I have contributed, I think more than 300 or something. Mm -hmm. or maybe, yeah, something like that. But you can always, yeah, so you can put it as your favorite. You can star mark, uh, you, which you use it more often and uh, recents as well. Yeah, and um, Balaji, uh, I hope I pronounce your name right. Ask, can we create uh, comic strips? Yes, there's a, a template. If you can put a comic. Uh... So you can see all the comics. <laughs> and of course, you can change every part of it. So uh, uh, yeah, so you can, if you want other figures or uh, other speech bulbs or whatever, you can change it. Maybe I want, I don't want this. I, 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 in my story, I don't want these characters, but I'm happy with the speech bubbles. I'm taking out the characters. And this I love. In Canva, when we take things out, it, it's un invisible. It's almost lost. And now here, this is good that outside the boundary as well, I can see this. And now I can include illustrations. Let's say I want to have a manager here. And then I can put pull this here, manager, right? And I can just copy and paste and more managers and, can, and I can change the color of this manager, let's say to red. So I can change the dresses and then I can delete these if you wish. Yeah. And Suman asked the AI searches not from Google, but only from uh, Droify. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So maybe I don't think, uh, tell me the news from today. I don't think it will be able to tell me news from today, right? <laughs> I'm not sure. I never tried that. Uh, by the way, if you are a hero user, which is one of the plans that I guess Piyush will explain, then you can also ask for drawing. So if there's something you can't find, you can ask us. And within the three days, uh, three, four days, we upload it on a platform. So we, we create it. Our artists get a request and they create it and we upload it. Yeah. So of course, you will not get current news. This is not the platform for getting current news, folks. But maybe one day, uh, who knows, Google, Bard and all, they will have their handshakes, API handshakes, and then our Maya can handshake with the current news as well. That will be fun, right? Yeah. That will be fun. Okay. So how do you maybe get drawn one, one question, Piyush? Yeah. Maybe one. Um, how do I take the content created to Miro and Miro? Miro, you yeah. have to upload it separately, but Miro, there is an integration. So you can go directly from Miro to um, Droify and Ver vice versa. So you can upload it on your toolbar and then you can work from Miro to Droify and vice versa. Um, and yes, um, the it lo all looks the same. There are much more templates that than what we have seen today in the in Maya and there will be by the end of yeah next month probably 100 different. So normally it should be yeah. much more different yeah. in the future. Pictures, click on pictures and sales and then you will see more than 53 templates on pictures and sales. And actually these are I would call them visual stories because sketch note and visual stories have a little difference. Visual stories are real world uh, metaphors. Sketch notes are still uh, have blocks and visual blocks, but for like this is more of a sketch note. This is more of a visual story because you already see a ladder, which is a real world. At least in my definition, I differentiate between a sketch note and a story like this. But here you can see there are a lot of uh, models, a lot of um, um, mental models or templates if you want from research and design or strategy from planning and all of these, right? And we are adding all the dry fires. When we work, we keep adding templates and uh, it goes for a review and then uh, it becomes uh, available for public use as well. 
any other questions i am not able to uh, read the chats so excel i think you are reading how to download the final project will it be saved as png i already answered can we change the shape size of slides i think here right resize so here the resizing can happen and what else how do i take content created to miro mural yeah I, um, can we customize miro mural is here so if you go on miro and then uh, maybe excel you have to help me a little bit from where i can go if you go to a board, you can go to your, um, you see your plus, do you have a board? Yeah. Create a team board. So to answer your yeah, question, Bali, you, maybe you would uh, want to use Miro because Miro has that collaborative environment. Yeah. And so then you have that um, loop, um, the plus right? magnifying glass there on the, yeah. Yeah, here. Yeah. So then you can look for it and then you can uh, allow and then you have the integration and you have um, a bunch of yeah available drawings and if you want more you have to you can go to drawify register and then you have all the drive all the drawify images yeah which yeah. are 50000 images yeah. now comes the final point uh, how do you get this if you are impressed by this i have more things to impress you guys because we have been pushing excel to her limits Look at this. I know what Drawify started with and I am super impressed what it is for now. So if you are in um, Europe, this is only eight euros per month, which is almost nothing a price. And I only know how much I have bargained uh, Excel for the Indian price as well. So if you are wanting uh, a one month plan, this is uh, 8.25 uh, euros per month. And uh, hero plan, basically, basically a hero plan, right? Uh, mm -hmm. Maybe Excel, you want to take this up? No, no, no. So indeed, uh, so if you want Maya, it's the hero plan. So eh, yeah. just as you know, but indeed we have different prices for India. So if you're in India and you log in with an Indian IP, you will see different prices, which are much more interesting. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to make the others jealous. I'm sorry. Um, so, uh, so yeah, you have indeed, you can choose for a monthly plan or a yearly plan. Uh, the yearly plan is of course, much more interesting uh, price-wise. Um, and if you say, oh, I don't need the AI part, then it's a pro plan, which is um, which you can only buy per year, but it's much cheaper than the hero. But then you don't have the Maya feature. Yeah. yeah, but I also promised that you can have, I have two more things to say. Because you are attending this session and because you are connected with me, <laughs> I have convinced Excel to give my folks a special discount. So... You will get a special discount if you will use, I'm going back to my uh, slide. Uh, if you are using something like this, 30% discount, uh, Excel, or yeah. what was the percent? Yeah, 30% yeah. discount on the price. So basically eight euros, whether you buy a monthly plan or a hero plan, you get 30% discount if you flash this QR code. Uh, try to uh, flash this QR code. It will take you to this link, which has my... Uh, my ambassador code here and then you can log in and all the discounts will run but I promised you that I have a thing by which you can get it for free as well now how many of you want to see the free thing as well and even Excel doesn't know what crap I'm going to do <laughs> how many of you want to see the free version okay let me show you this folks so all those who are already connected with me who have done the master class with me I have something to show you why I have launched this thing what is this thing? So basically a four hour refresher course, all those who have attended an eight hour masterclass, you are already pro in drawing. I know that, but I receive a lot of queries that Piyush teach us how to make sketch notes digitally on iPads, on drawing uh, laptops, on Drawify, how to integrate chat GPT, which I have not shown you in this workshop, in this webinar, how to parallelly open a chat GPT and even make stories fabulous stories like a rocket launch or a roadmap or a jumping person or all these, how you can use chat GPT to integrate in your digital sketch notes. I am doing a four hours of upgrade training next Saturday, which is a 14th October. And these are the things which you will learn sketch notes using regular mouse. And so even if you don't have an iPad or a drawing tablet, just a mouse and a laptop, then also you will be able to use your uh, digital sketch notes, uh, how to use it on tablets, laptops, uh, you will also be getting my pre-designed digital templates and stickers. Many of you know about this, how to use Drawify in detail, how to use chat GPT, and also how to use digital on Canva and your PowerPoint and on Google Slides as well. What is this? You will also get 
why I'm saying you that DrawFi is free because if you are joining that workshop, then your DrawFi will be on me. So I'll be sponsoring your DrawFi account. Okay. So Excel, that's the thing. I'll be sponsoring you for your for your DrawFi. And this four hour thing, be surprised, folks. I know you won't believe this. This is only priced at rupees seventeen ninety nine for India, and this is only for forty registrations. I'll show you a QR code. Uh, you can flash it. If you are from outside India, then I have to refresh it. If you are from outside India, then the price is $59 for a four hour of workshop. You can click on this and you will be able to book it. I am flashing this here. Uh, maybe you want to take this, uh, take a screenshot of this and then book it from here. So this QR code will take you to joining the four hours of training and you will join the four hours of training. You will also buy DrawFi, but you will be reimbursed for the DrawFi. So as I told you, your DrawFi account will be sponsored by me. Okay, and you get a four hour extra with me for the trainings. That's it. If you are not, you have not attended my earlier workshops and maybe you are very new to Sketchnotes, then we, I also have a two day program. Kindly ping me personally on the WhatsApp because I was not able to fit this in the slide, but I'll be sharing you the two day program, which is uh, on in November, 4th and 5th of November. Okay, take a picture of this. This was it from our side, from uh, Excel side. Um, if you have any questions, I'm still here. We still have five minutes. I am always happy being an Indian when I finish on time. It's a wow thing for me. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah sure. on what, time. <laughs> what, what's the time of that course in the UK? Oh, yeah. So this is uh, one thirty p.m. in India, which means in the UK, this is 3.30 in your, oh, you are one hour behind. So I think it will be four and a half hours, which means your time will be eight o'clock in the morning, eight to 12. Right, thank you. Eight to 12 in the morning. Yeah, I'm still open to questions. Excel is also here for the questions. Yeah. And I can also tell you one thing. I got an opportunity in to visit Excel's office in Belgium. Excel, we would love to see your office, actually. <laughs> At least I want to show my participants your office. Excel's office. office. <laughs> I so took, uh, yeah, uh, the board is there, so you don't see the miss. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. But visit her office in Belgium and yeah. it is full of visuals, full of visuals. <laughs> I only have much visual in my office. Yeah. Okay, folks, any other questions if you have? Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, Piyush, someone is asking the discount code for the 30%. Can you show it again? Mm, yeah. Um, okay. Keep taking pictures, folks. Uh, or maybe you will also receive an email with all the details. So only 30% discount if you wish. This is your uh, code. Take a picture of this. Only DrawFi. Or if you want to attend a session as well, then take a picture of this as well. And Kartik, if you are ever in Belgium, please let me know. <laughs> you are welcome. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. <laughs> I'll do that. Okay. Any other questions or any other things which you have to say? Any other feelings, folks? Uh, share your feelings. What do you think? I think the integration with Mario Board is going to be amazing. That's fantastic. Oh, I'd, love yeah. to, I'd love to share that with the facilitators community and um, work with you on that. It would be great. Okay, thanks, yeah. uh, Trevor. That's a uh, and also on the uh, backgrounds, Axel, as Piyush was trying out different options, it was giving the same background like the roadmap with the six mm -hmm. bullet points. Maybe if there is a feature that uh, AI okay. can throw up different uh, backgrounds, like you have the different templates within the DrawFi tool. Maybe if AI Maya mm -hmm. can uh, Maya can yeah. take the templates in, I think that will be a good. That will be absolutely the next step. We we just launched it and we are uh, actually we are raising funding <laughs> to make it bigger. And as soon as we have the funding, we can go all the way. <laughs> and also uh, maybe uh, the illustrations part as well, like I shared with you on the chat, yeah. storyset.com, yeah. flat icon. Yeah. I think okay. apart from the what visual uh, thinking experts have already put in in the uh, dashboard if we have integration from an illustration site then yeah. it gives more flexibility for example if i'm i was searching for alphabets today for uh, creating a to z of mental health mm -hmm. internally I'm, i've created a visual guide on mental health but i couldn't find specific set of alphabets in the same uh, design that i wanted so i had to oh, yeah. use icons from flat icon i paid a premium license for it i downloaded all of them yeah. and then uploaded into DrawFi and then used it. So oh, yeah. there is an integration from uh, an illustration site. Maybe it will expand yeah. the scope of DrawFi. Yeah, mm -hmm. thanks a lot, Kathy. I've noted that from your last uh, WhatsApp. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, 
Yeah. Uh, yeah. How do you change language? Uh, uh, to be truly honest, I didn't do that for a long time. Piyush, do you know? I know it's possible because um, Rana, yeah, our uh, Roy Fire from uh, Saudi Arabia, she's doing it. But uh, do you know how? Let's try. Let's try. Let's try. My experiments are good. <laughs> so what should I do? It's terrible. Uh, I should know it, but I never do it, so I don't know it. <laughs> and otherwise, uh, otherwise we will let you know. Version? 2.0 version, it was pretty easy. Uh, uh, maybe here, 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 let's see, outfit, uh, recent, all, uh, Hindi bold, but this is just bold. Uh, pom, 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 all. Uh, How did you change it before? Because we didn't change that feature, so normally it should be the same. <laughs> There's no <laughs> language option, I think. There's only the fonts that you can change. Yeah. Uh, there's there's no language that you can change. No, not the language, it's the fonts. So you don't, ah, yeah, you, you want to change the language. Okay, no, 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 I was thinking the fonts. No, no, you can't change the language. What you, uh, of course you can just write in your own language. What you can do is uh, change your Google settings. If you are in Google Chrome and you change your Google settings, then you will see the, yeah, the, the website in your own language, of course. But in Royify it will be, yeah, the search and everything will be in English. Uh, maybe so enter the translated text into the box. Copy the translated text into the yeah. box on this. Yeah, that, that works. That works. Yeah. Yeah. So we you can use other fonts. <laughs> He's and, yeah. changed it to Persian. <laughs> Greek and Latin. <laughs> I can't I can't read it. <laughs> so if, if I'm can't. presenting it to the boss and I'm scolding him in Persian, he wouldn't know, right? <laughs> That's a good example, Krish. Okay. Uh, Suban, glad you have the answer. Yeah, cool. So folks, uh, you will also receive an email with all the important links which I shared with you, the discount link and everything. I hope you like the session. We tried to fill it in with as much value as possible. Mm -hmm. I hope you liked it. And maybe we'll meet it again uh, in some of the Droify uh, jamming sessions. Yeah, yeah, thanks a lot for being here. And uh, mm -hmm. I hope to see you. Because every month we have sessions eh, in, uh, in, in Droify, so feel free to join. Oh, we, we didn't share about, do you want to, no, I think we shared it everything, yeah? So explore Roy5, folks, uh, explore it. Uh, there might be a trial version as well. And um, if you are convinced, I would encourage you. I wish I could show you the Indian price because I was very, very surprised. It's 50% discount. I hope. It's 50% cheaper. So it's yeah. a price yeah. for in people from so it's India. It's almost four. It's almost 400 rupees, folks. And on that also, you are getting 30% discount. So it's almost nothing a price. And of course, if you want a free version, you want, you know the- Axel, so 50% for you, 50% for Piyush. So I get 100% free, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, almost. It's, it's nothing a price, trust me, guys. It's yeah, but then I, can't, <laughs> that, then I can't even get <laughs> further. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I already have an account with Drawify. Uh, so uh, will this version have to be uh, paid additionally for the AI one? Uh, if you have the pro version, you have need to upgrade to the hero version. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah. So the pro version isn't uh, doesn't include my. Uh, and PH, I uh, this is for you. Uh, I want to know if the there's another session which uh, you know the digital one post next Saturday because. I'm traveling, so you will have more of these, right? Uh, it's the first time you're announcing this, so. Uh... I am doing in India, okay, this is an announcement. I'm also traveling to India from 15th of November to 20th of January. And this time, even in an in-person workshop, I'll be teaching, taking the digital sketchnoting as well. So maybe you want to attend an in-person, but if it's an online version, yes, of course, I'll be announcing more. Yeah, but I've already done the seven-hour masterclass with you. So and <laughs> so I just want to know if you'll be having this Saturday thing again, because it's yeah, only yeah. one plate that we will have. We will have. We will have. Let's see what is the response. This is the first time. Let's see if more people are joining in, then I'll be doing it even more. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, folks. It's six. It's 4.30 here, and I'm pretty sure it must be dinner time in India, and a lot of for all, a lot of you, tea time. Enjoy your evening. Enjoy, Enjoy your evening. Thank you. Thanks for joining. Thanks, everyone. Bye. -bye. Thank you. Bye. One second. I want to call you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check. Tell me. Tell me. Uh, okay, so actually, my network was disconnected. That's why I cannot do it. The last, how to get this free draw file? You said some session, no? What it is? Can you explain just a minute? 
Okay, you can just take a picture of this. I'm just quickly sharing my screen. No, I took the picture, but the voice was the disturbance. Uh, can you explain last that uh, thing? The four hours uh, flying thing. training. Yeah, this, yeah, can yeah. Can you see the screen? Yeah. Four hours. So this is yeah, the, yeah, yeah. Four hours. Something four hours. Anything. Okay. And this is specifically on uh, using the digital version. So we'll not go deeper into drawing part of it. I'm expecting that okay. you might have done a workshop with me. This is specifically yeah, yeah. to teach you how to use digital tools for drawing and not only drawing, but drag and drop and everything, how to make your own stickers for your PowerPoints, everything digital might not go too much in detail because four hours are not good enough for drawing practice, but everything apart from okay. drawing will be uh, used. These are the I'm things. In screenshot, yeah, yeah, you can take a screenshot as well. Okay. Or full folks, I mean, you can take a picture from your phone. Recording a real okay, okay, okay. Cool. Then I will see to attend the time. Time. Yeah. Can you are still saying something, or we can take a leave. Uh, I think just noise. Okay, bye, folks. Thanks, Excel, for joining in. Bye bye, bye, Pish. Thanks for doing for the session. Now. Bye-bye. Always loving Dry Fi. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> Bye.